Hello everyone. Let's learn today ethmoidal air sinuses. Now, ethmoidal air sinuses are 3 to 18 in number and they are found within the ethmoid bone, which is an example of pneumatic bone. And ethmoidal air sinuses are basically found between the medial wall of the orbit. Now, this is orbit and this is its medial wall. So, the sinuses are found deep to the medial wall of the orbit and lateral to the nasal cavity, right? So, somewhere over here, deep to this, there lies ethmoidal air sinuses. Now, these sinuses are divided into three groups anterior, middle, and posterior group. Now, over here, you can see this is maxilla and this is frontal process of the maxilla. This is attached to the frontal bone. This bone is lacrimal bone okay and behind to it this portion or this bony plate is orbital plate of the ethmoid right so deep to the frontal process of maxilla and lacrimal bone there lies anterior ethmoidal sinuses and deep to this orbital plate of the ethmoid there lies middle and posterior ethmoidal sinuses anterior ethmoidal sinuses are approximately 3 to 7 in number whereas middle ethmoidal sinuses are 1 to 3 in number and most posteriorly, the posterior ethmoidal sinuses are approximately 1 to 10 in number, right? So, let me show you the orientation of the ethmoidal sinuses. For that, I'll illuminate these sinuses by throwing a beam of light through nasal aperture. See this. So, now the sinuses are illuminated. And over here you can see this is lacrimal bone and this is frontal process of maxilla so here lies the anterior ethmoidal sinuses now over here you can see the middle ethmoidal sinuses okay and deep to the orbital plate of ethmoid and still most posteriorly you can see the posterior ethmoidal sinuses right so they are found deep to the orbit between orbit and the lateral nasal wall right now if you see the sinuses in the separate bone and this is ethmoid now in the ethmoid there are certain portions certain parts so this is cribriform plate of ethmoid and over here you can see a triangular bony plate this is cristacali right and on either side of it these are two labyrinths so the sinuses are found within the labyrinth and deep inside you can see this is the perpendicular plate of ethmoid. For detailed structure of the ethmoid bone, please refer to my another video regarding anatomy of the ethmoid bone. But over here you can see the ethmoidal air sinuses. The anterior ethmoidal sinuses as we have talked, they are exposed because in articulated skull they are completed by the frontal process of maxilla and lacrimal bone so here they are lying and this one is the orbital plate of ethmoid so deep to it lies middle and posterior ethmoidal sinuses the anterior ethmoidal sinuses will open into the anterior part of the hiatus semilunaris into the middle meatus of the nose whereas the middle ethmoidal sinuses they form ethmoidal bulla this is ethmoidal bulla and they again open into middle meatus at the summit of the bulla or just above the bulla right whereas the posterior ethmoidal sinuses they open into superior meatus of the nose so here lies the ethmoidal sinuses right into the uh, labyrinth of the ethmoid and this is perpendicular plate of the ethmoid in between the labyrinth and perpendicular plate you can see the nasal cavity right so this is regarding ethmoidal air sinuses Hope you understood well. Thanks for watching.